out of theater reaction to speak no evil. What's up, everybody? It's the movie guy. Sorry I didn't do my out of theater reaction to speak no evil earlier, but my phone was basically just about dead. So, um, just a side note, if anybody's going to Europe, don't befriend a, co a couple and if they ask you to be like, hey, you should like, you know, come visit us, come stay with us for like a week, you know, come see the farmhouse. Just say no, just say no. Be like, no, nah, I've got some stuff at work I got to get tied up with. Uh, but if you do go to somebody's house, a couple that you meet uh, from over in Europe and they have stains on their sheet, just pack up and leave. Just pack up and leave. I thought James McAvoy was great. I love these roles uh, of his. And uh, Mackenzie Davis, I think her uh, character of Louise, I think she was like the only rational character in this whole movie. So a non-spoiler, but it's just intense. It's crazy. The twist is crazy. Um, they meet James McAvoy and his wife uh, and his son while they're over in Europe and then they're just like, hey, you know, they, they, I think they exchange info addresses and James McAvoy sends them a postcard when they go back to London be like, hey, you know what? Come stay with us for a week, you know? And then they were kind of on the fence about it and they decide to, and I'll just say, it just gets crazy as the day go by that they're there they have so many chances to leave. They kind of leave and then they decide, you know, let's go back and all this stuff and everything. And oh my God. Oh, I didn't look at Rotten Tomatoes score, but one of my friends at work when I was getting the passes said it was holding a 90% on Rotten Tomatoes. And I forgot it was a Blumhouse movie. Blumhouse, kudos to you because they have been kind of down lately on movies. I mean, like Night Swim, Imaginary, uh, Tarot. I think Tarot was Blumhouse. They were just eh, borderline okay, but man, Speak No Evil was a movie. Oh, I knew I was going to like it. I knew it was going to be good. I had no idea it was going to be great. I give it a 9.3 out of 10. This movie is great. It's more than likely going to pop into my top five favorite movies of 2024. I actually like this better than Long Legs, but nothing taken away from Long Legs because I thought that was an amazing movie. I had a blast with Long Legs, but Speak No Evil was just on another level of craziness at the edge of my seat. And I'll tell you what, you know what? I would take a road trip with James McAvoy just to listen to music going from California to New York. I, I you know what? That would be an awesome road trip. You'll kind of know what I'm talking about. Uh, when uh, you see the movie but if anybody has seen Speak No Evil just give me your non-spoiler thoughts in the comment section or if you're going to see it this weekend uh, hit me up I'm definitely interested to hear what other movie fans think of Speak No Evil but definitely a thumbs up uh, it was really good so definitely go see Speak No Evil this weekend